Hello everybody, welcome to Digital Painting and Photography channel. This is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer, I shot this image a couple months ago. Well, I made illustration type of image uh, last month when I shot. Um, but I want to try again with this fresco. I don't know how it's going to turn out. I want to use, I maybe change different way to express this image. Pretty nice clean image, isn't it? Well, glass bottle design is so nice. That's fantastic. Huh? Beautiful bottle design. Okay, and I have this image and also I made this pencil drawing type image by Adobe Photoshop used filter code find edges as always. And uh, this is nice pencil drawing type in image as well. Well, let me see. Let me start with digital painting, changing blend mode to look at it. How it's gonna turn out. Let's see. Nice color. Huh? Hmm. A light image on these leaves. That's nice. Overlay. Divide. Nice and shiny image on this glass. I mean the uh, bottle designs. Okay, luminosity. That's a little reddish, huh? Well, about this pencil drawing type image, maybe overlay image we can use for these leaves. That's nice. Let me see. Let me duplicate this original image. Turn off this pencil drawing type image now and then uh, duplicate this original then change blend mode. Hmm, so much darken. That's kind of cool, huh? Like a base image make this color burn image then I add some over this dark image use this overlay image on leaves or maybe divide shiny level image on this dark image well let me see let me continue to check it out Okay, let me see, this color, I'm just curious if I add some lighter color on this dark image, how it looks like. Yeah, let me check it out. Okay, now lighter color is just like screen, I don't know. I don't know if I am. Let me see. Okay, screen image. No, divide the image. This is screen blend mode. Well, this is original image. Lighten up some divide effect. Is, that's nice too. 50? Even so, that's nice. Well, this is pretty good shot, huh? Darken colors and Divide to shiny label. Touch. Okay, let me finish up this base image. Darken colors with this. So create the empty mask. Brushes basic to soft round opacity to hide this.
Not much. Okay, now about this divide effect. Now I don't need to lighten up here. This pencil drawing type image divide effect is maybe only for this label design. So about 80. Create empty mask. Now invert mask. Then only four. Now hide. I mean, uh, reveal this pencil drawing type image to lighten up this design of the um, bottle design. Shiny area. Not much. And bubble touch. Maybe that's enough. Yeah. Maybe some of this. Okay. Touch. Alright, so far. Okay. I'm gonna continue to make more nice image. Okay. This is the base image. Now I want to look for lighten up this leaves image. That's what I need to do. So just wanna let's see lighten. Okay, duplicate this original image first of all. This is basic image now so far. I just wanna leave this image. This is the way. So I'm gonna duplicate this layer original image move up all the way top then again i'm gonna duplicate this original two images then one of the top change blend mode to let's see color dodge to lighten up this leaves texture color dodge or linear dodge maybe a linear dodge lighten up shadow side color dodge is a little more contrast okay in this case though let me see the base image let me see turn on this turn off this originals we see some shadows so maybe we can make this originals Okay, much more contrast on color dodge. So I want to match down this original, these two original images to make lighten these leaves texture. Then I'm going to match down or I'm going to make mask to combine. So this is original image. Okay, I'm going to match down. Then create empty mask. Now invert this mask. Then we got this original base image, right? Now I'm going to reveal this to the same brush. Just small size of the soft round opacity to get some contrast highlight area. Touch. Maybe about this much, all right? How's this? Okay, I guess that's cool. All right, this is four leaves. This is color dodge effect image, only four leaves. Lighten up. Okay, this is the base image, finally. Okay little more natural look. Let me see about this mask. Uh, 
Okay. How's this? All right. Now, let's see. From here, I got the base image. A lot better than the original image. Yeah, touch more image. Or just reveal maybe darken outside. Okay, how about this way? Select multiple. Oh, the layers. Well, duplicate layers. Then merge selected. Now we got the one layer image. Okay. Now, let's see. With the oil paint. Then maybe oil paint flat. Let me see. With no color. Just texture. How much I can move around this outside. Okay, change oil paint brush, oil paint round. Nice to have texture, canvas texture. Okay, almost done. Get texture of the oil paint brush. Okay, overall texture. Now we're gonna get an idea. Okay, and now I'm gonna create an empty mask. Then hide some with, let's see, soft round opacity is fine. You see the mask here, really small. Yeah, part of the image you want to show, this sharp image, but not much. Let's see with this mask, just tone down this brush texture so okay I guess that's it then uh, maybe we can add some white layer on this but I don't know if I need that like this to this well you got the idea now um, okay this is the original image and same original image change blend mode to color burn opacities 50% to darken colors like so then add pencil drawing type image change blend mode to divide opacity 80% to lighten up this design of the bottle lighten up then 
fix this image as a one layer then change this image to lighten up leaves to get this color dodge original image with mask to lighten up leaves like so this is the base image then I well sort of smudging type idea to get this oil paint type of texture on the image add it like so with mask like this to this well that's the idea well thank you for watching my video and uh, I hope you can get some kind of idea for your creative work and I really appreciate for you guys support and uh, you guys have a nice day and see you next time bye now ciao good day